We are students from Hope Street Family Center in downtown Los Angeles. What kind of needs do you guys see in your communities? We walk the streets on our way to school and see a lot of people in need. We see homeless people walking around barefoot, wearing shoes that don't fit, socks that are dirty or have holes in them. We thought maybe we could help. We all called you here today because we want you to be part of something big. A big service project to show our appreciation to those who give so much to us, right? What are some needs that you guys think that maybe as a group we can tackle together and make a difference? Juan? Um, we could get like care packages to the homeless. Karen? Um, give clothes to homeless people. Alejandro? Homeless people need um, some shoes. They also might need socks because we're not just gonna, I mean, they can't just wear shoes without socks. Raise your hands if you like the shoes with socks idea. Can we do this, guys? We need more duct tape. So we only want gently use or you should only because we want the homeless people to have good quality shoes. They're all at different ages and they're willing to help their community where they live, where they come to school and after school program. It's really great for them to have the heart and the neck to do this now because it just shows us the type of kids that we're breeding to become adults. Keep on helping out people. These kids have been researching companies who donate products. We checked in companies that help donate free socks. Oh, look! From this account. Soft donations giving back. Yes, there, there you go, because then that's what we're trying to help, help. We're trying to help homeless people out. See. We are uh, looking to meet new gift, gifting partners. Watch this video to learn more about our gifting program. We sell socks. We found out that socks are the number one most requested clothing item at homeless shelters. So for every pair we sell, we donate a pair to someone in need. Yes, sir. How can we apply to become a giving Partner. So these two kids, they're one of our neediest families, they're siblings, and there's, I think there are five other children in the home, and they live in a studio apartment, okay? And I asked Licha, I said, why, are you, why do you feel so strongly about this cause, Licha? And she says, because I see it every time when I walk down the street. I run into families, and I don't have a lot to give, but I see kids and families who have less than I do, and it makes me want to give something back to them. Last time I was just walking through Hollywood and there was like some mom with some two kids and I, I'm guessing they were homeless. And I saw them looking at my food. So like, I, I really didn't have that much change. I just had a dollar, so I just threw it in there. And then the two kids were like, oh, thank you. And I was like, okay. I mean, that's just a testament to the heart that our kids have. And even if they have so little, the capacity to give is still within them. It's still inside them, and they still want to help others even if they have so little. I mean, what, what a beautiful thing. What a beautiful thing. Good job, guys. Welcome! Dear Bombas, we don't have everything we want in our lives, but it's plain to see that there are others who have it worse than us. In our after-school program, we decided to have a shoes and socks drive to try and make a difference. As we searched the internet, we found you, Bombas. We decided that we should give you a call or send an email. And here we are. Please give us some socks to help our, with our donation. Wonderful. How many shoes and socks would you donate this year? We are trying to donate 1,000 pairs of socks and shoes oh. this year. <laughs> wow. That's an amazing goal. Will you give us a second while we see if we can make a decision? Yes. yes. Okay. All right, no looking. Huh? We've come to a decision. We would be honored to give you 1,000 pairs of no socks way. to cover your goal for this. Wow. Yay! You think it, man? You did it. Yay! Good job. <laughs> Socks. 1,000 pair of Bomba socks that the kids got for us. Wow! We are the Bomba Sock Army! Woo! Awesome! 
come inside this way? We have about 100,000 homeless guests who come and utilize our breakfast program, and then we also have a shower program. So 3,500 homeless guests who are able to take a shower annually here. So anytime they take a shower, what do we give them when they come out? Socks. This is going to be amazing because you know what? If you don't have a clean pair of socks, you just don't feel so good, do you? Thank you guys so much for everything that you did and thinking about our community too. You know that our community gave us a lot. We are trying to give back. And I think this is going to impact a lot of people in our community. There's a lot of different ways to give that to other people. Are you supposed to